Hello everyone, Mr. Mottershead here. I think the book that I'm going to read to you is quite unusual. Would you like to read the title with me? Let's read it together. The book with no pictures. The book with no pictures? You can't have a book with no pictures. Well, let's see how it goes. Are you sitting comfortably? I'm not. Here it is, the book with no pictures. This is a book with no pictures. Doesn't seem to be any pictures so far. It might seem like no fun to have someone read you a book with no pictures. I think so. It probably seems boring and serious. Except... Here is how the book works. Everything the words say, the person reading the book has to say. Well, that's pretty obvious, isn't it, really? No matter what. Hmm. I'm a bit suspicious now. That's the deal. That's the rule. So that means even if the words say... Blog. Wait, what? That doesn't even mean anything. Blurf. Wait a second, what? That isn't the kind of word I wanted to read. And I have to say every word the book says. Oh no. I am a monkey who taught myself to read. Hey, I'm not a monkey. And now I am reading you this book with my monkey mouth in my monkey voice. No, no, I'm not. That's not true. I'm not a monkey, am I? Who said yes? Yes, I am a monkey. I'm a robot monkey. What? What's a robot monkey? And my head is made of blueberry pizza. What a second! Is this whole book a trick? Can I stop reading, please? No. And now it's time for me to sing to you my favourite song. Oh no, a song! Do I really have to sing it? Glug, 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 my face is a bug. I eat ants for breakfast right off the rug. What? This book is ridiculous. Can I stop reading yet? No. What about you, boys and girls? Can I stop reading? You said no as well. Oh. There are more pages. I have to read the rest. My only friend in the whole wide world is a hippo named Boo Boo Butt. Boo Boo Butt. And also, the kid I'm reading this book to is the best kid ever in the history of the world. Oh, is that so? Did you say yes? And this kid is the smart kid too. Because this kid chose this book even though it had no pictures. Because kids know this is the book that makes grown-ups have to say silly things. Oh, is that what it's all about? And make silly sounds like... Oh no, here it comes! Glurga woko ma grufa do ee 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 brug 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 excuse me oomph oomph blaggity blaggity glibbity globbity globbity glibbity beep boop ee
Ba dungay face. Dungay face? That's not me. Oh no, my goodness. What comes next? Please don't ever make me read this book again. It's so silly. In fact, it is completely and utterly preposterous. Next time, please, please, please choose a book with pictures. Please, because this is just too ridiculous to read. The end. Bonk. I didn't say that. Well, did it make me look silly reading that book? Did you enjoy it? Well, it's obviously made me look very, very funny. So I hope you enjoy it. I hope you all keep well. And I look forward to seeing your happy, smiling faces again very, very soon. Bye-bye then. Bye. And remember, the book with no pictures. I better give the full title by B.J. Novak.